Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. First, I'm going to start off with the time. I upgraded it. It's pink and it's a different font. It is 12.22, Sunday morning. Uh-huh. I have upgraded this video so much that we have a new candle. Because the old one was really just too much. So, I have this one. And my lighter is much more bouge. It's uh, this one. So, light a candle with me. And, and, um, um, the acknowledgement that the Lord is with us, um, here in this room with me and as you watch this video. I need to stick this in water. I'll do that later. Anyways, today, I know this, I prepared ahead of time. I am going to be doing a video over Mark chapter 3. Also, I have my AirPods in. It's even more bougie than last time. Anyways, I hope you can enjoy this one better. Okay, let's get started. Jesus heals on the Sabbath. So Jesus was walking and went to the synagogue one day and there was a man with a shriveled hand. Anyways, some Pharisees were there to watch Jesus very carefully to see if Jesus would heal on the Sabbath. Jesus was like, stand up. Then Jesus asked the Pharisees, which is better, to do good or evil on the Sabbath? The Pharisees were too stunned to speak. <laughs> Jesus saw that their hearts were very stubborn. So Jesus said to the man, stretch out your hand. It was a miracle. But still the Pharisees went out and plotted to harm Jesus. Jesus went out one day and went to the lake. People from all over heard about this. Jesus was like, how am I going to fit in a boat with all these people? So his disciples built him a different boat so that he could be away from the crowd. Like a boss. So many people on the boat were healed from impure spirits, and they would bow down and say, you are the son of God, and they would bow before him. Jesus told them not to tell anybody about him and the miracles. Jesus approaches the twelve. So Jesus went up on a mountainside and brought everybody who he wanted. He brought Sir Peter, Jamity, Brother John, Andy, Phil, Bart, Maddie, Tomas, Jameson, Fatty, Simone, and Judas. Jesus accused by his family and the teachers of the law. So Jesus entered a house and the crowd was so big this time that his disciples and him couldn't even eat. This family was like, he is out of his mind. The Pharisees were like, this is what I've been telling you. He is the prince of demons. Jesus was like, guys, gather around. Look, how could Satan drive out Satan? If a kingdom is divided, it can't stand. And no one can enter a strong man's house before you tie the strong man up. I tell you, people can be forgiven of every sin and every slander, but whoever blasphemies against the Holy Spirit will never be forgiven. Jesus said all this because they were saying he has an impure spirit. Then Jesus' mother and brothers arrived and someone was like, hey, they're here. And Jesus was like, guys, who are my mother and brothers? It's you guys. Here are my mother and brothers. Whoever does God's will is my mother and brother. Hey guys, 
so the time is now 1.47. Bro, I'm so tired. <laughs> um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, before we go, I'm gonna sing a goodbye song. That's all I got. To close out this video, I will now be blowing out this candle. It doesn't even smell like anything. No reward. Okay. Thanks for watching.